Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is Whoopi speaking, and we go on on this Figuera Generator. Fantasticos. Okay, and I made a lot of words this last uh, hours, and uh, especially with uh, the Arduino. And uh, I use the Wonju uh, Soft to power this this system here with a transistor and resistor and everything and I got almost the same result as with uh, the rotative rotors as I had exactly the same uh, waveform and then I tried to make some difference in the resistor on the bank of resistor um, uh, changing the resistor in the middle uh, more uh, more resistor in the middle and less at the outside and the uh, contrary and test it, everything but not very significant result and the best of all that I could if you see on the other it was a bunch of wire here I simply put all away and I simply got the last one because I noticed something when I use for instance this kind of coil with very high DC resistance and a lot of uh, inductance. It is a, a fan motor of a micro oven. It is about 200 uh, um, uh, ohms. I got this scale system, uh, scale wave. Nice tick 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 up wave and tick 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 down. But as soon as I change this coil and use press uh, this small one it is only 30 ohms 13 ohms 1 3 ohms okay it was almost a flat and then poof as a as a square wave something so but always in the middle of the um, the, the cycle All right so i decided to try only to put the on external here so you have the System will we watch zoop max zoop to level and the on the down uh, system it is zoop the zoom okay hope you understand me <laughs> but for tonight I wanted to show you something very very interesting because I use this here and uh, I decided to first to show to you my power system here and I will I have to find it where it is it okay now the Arduino is free I don't connect the Arduino at all okay so the Arduino is working as standalone right I put the power on and you see the Arduino on itself is taking six and a half volt and uh, uh, 26 milliamps okay now I will connect this uh, coil to the Arduino. I will do it. Uh, tuck, it is made. A light change about uh, four milliamps. Okay, a six volt. But now we have a trace on the scope, and the trace on the scope shows on the upper the voltage, and down the uh, current. All right. And now I have put this secondary here, and you see one of the LED. The other LED is here, but it is not lit because it it, it lacks the second U. All right. Now, if I put away the secondary, the LED is off. I put in the LED is on. On the power supply, the LED is on now. The LED is off. Nothing. It is on, it is off, so it is on, so it is off. Mm -hmm. Interesting, but now much more interesting. Look at this trace here. You see, so that is on. You see that the peak of the current is slightly shifted on the right. It is not totally in phase. And the LED is on. Now the LED is off. <laughs> no phase shift at all. 
Hop, ladies on. Ladies off. Ladies on. Ladies off. Yep. Very, very interesting. No safety at all between current and voltage when the secondary is loaded or not. <laughs> tick tock, tick tock. Yes, I think I will wind a lot of other of these sea coils these next days. Thank you very much, Mr. Figuera. And good night at all.